Hey, snag! So, almost time for you to get going, huh, snag? So how about we finish up early today, bud? Welcome back for more of STZLPs with The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. In the last episode, uh, Talo got lost in the woods, so we found him and got him back to the village. So yeah, we're, we're all successful here. Uh, so for this episode, we're going to be uh, herding up the goats really fast this time because we don't really want that to be an issue. I apologize if there's any echo in the microphone. I forgot to turn down the volume on my TV. Huzzah. Anyways, okay then, let's get started. For dinner! Okay, so this time we got to herd 20 goats. I don't know how they suddenly multiplied overnight. They've been greedy. But yeah, anyways. Uh, so this time there's actually a bit of a time limit. It's not that important though, it's just more like a personal goal type thing. But if you feel like it, um, if you can get it under three minutes, the guy at the front's actually going to give you a compliment. He's going to be like, wow, nice job, better than usual, Flink. But if you get it below there, he's, he will be disappointed and you will be all sad. You'll be all sad and have sad face. But yes, uh, so we're just going to run to get the goats into the barn real quick. It's not a big deal. They're basically saying, okay, you did it once, but can you do it again? I think I can, because I'm pretty good at this. And look at that, I'm getting a whole bunch of them in at the same time. I'm doing pretty good. Okay, uh, what is that? Oh, that's a goat. Okay, I was like, it looks kind of weird the way it's turning. Okay, fine, one goat. Yeah, that, that'll be so successful. My mom will be so proud of me. For getting a whole goat. They make whole milk. Yeah, whatever. Uh, did it go in? Yeah. <laughs> We'll go figure, right? It worked out for the best. Oh, yeah, move! Move! <laughs> uh, technically, I don't think you can actually hit him when you're on the horse, but uh, you could try. I mean, he usually just runs out of the way. Um, if you whoop too much when you're near the goats, they'll actually get mad at you and start charging you and turning red. So you want to be aware of that. You don't want to keep pressing the A button too much while you're doing this, because it will become problematic. I can guarantee that much. <laughs> So come on, there's always that one last guy that just never agrees, and I did it in a minute and 15 seconds remaining. Nice. Oh boy, y'all can herd. That was one minute and 15 seconds faster than usual. You were timing us, what? Why do you time us? Seriously, dude. Well, that's about wraps her up for the day. How about y'all head over to Mayor's place? Yep, today's the day we begin our epic adventure to Hyrule Castle. Deliver a message. Yeah, that's all our tiny little town ever gets to do. Sad, isn't it? Oh, done hurting for the day, Snag? Well, nice work. The royal gift Russell told you is ready, so you should head ready for the trip to the Hyrule Castle. Now, the royal family requested this gift specifically, so it's real special. It'd be bad if the representative of Lordon were to be late for such an occasion. You get me, lad? The path before you is a long one, my sweet horse. But please bear Sna Snag safely along it. Wait, what's this? What's happened? She's injured, isn't she? Snag, how could you? You were pushing transfer too hard again. I bet you hurt her leg jumping fences, didn't you? Now, now, Leah, there's no need to get all mad at him. Father! How could you be so easy on him? You're the mayor! You should start acting like one! You poor thing. It'll be alright, Transfer. I'll take you to the Forest Spring right now. 
Once we soothe you in the spirit spring, you'll feel better in no time. Wait, wait, where? Why, without transfer, the gift won't get delivered in time. Oh, this won't do. Seriously, what's this girl's problem with taking my horse? This is the second time now. I'm keeping count. This is the second time you've taken my horse. What the hell? Do you have, like, f a horse horse fetish or something? Seriously. Well, if you're going to the spring, I guess I have to go over there as well. Get my horse back. You know, that's my horse! You can't be taking my horse! That's my horse! Snag? Are you going to see Leah? Yeah. Maybe it's me, but those guys don't normally let people through. Um, Snag, you think... We can go to see Leah together? Eh, sure, why not? Why not? Let's be a Wobbuffet and why not go over there? Make sure you stay along, though. Don't fall behind. I go fast, because I'm supersonic. Hey, we've been waiting for you, you know, Snag? <laughs> Yesterday was so much fun. Yeah, chasing monkeys was like that was great. I was just telling Mallow here about how we wanted to show it to him, but we let it go instead. Oh, you didn't get caught, Tallow? Oh, Colin! Way to spoil everything by telling your dad. Nice job. Yeah, thanks a lot. We got scolded by our dad. Something awful. I thought it would never end. I bet you're trying to go see Leah, aren't you? Well, there's no way I'm going to let you pass. Oh, hey, neat, Snag. Let me borrow that wooden sword. If I had a wooden sword yesterday, I could have handled it all alone. Definitely. Come on, let me borrow that wooden sword right now. Yeah, I don't see any harm, any harm in it. I mean, you'll just get a couple of splinters, but, you know, you can pull those out. There's no chance of getting an infection or anything. Whoa, well, yes! With this thing! I'll show him. Show who? Show tunes? Snag! Thanks. Those guys are always teasing me. What's so fun about swinging something like that around, anyway? I hate it. It's scary. When I grow up, I'm gonna be just like you, Snag. I don't want to learn about swords or anything, but could you teach me how to ride a horse sometime? Can you? You have to promise. What is with blonde-haired people in this game and horse fetishes? Seriously. I don't get it. I, 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 I don't get it. If you're blonde in this game, you have a horse fetish. Seriously. Anyways. We gotta go, go, go get my horse back! My horse! How dare people take my horse? What, what is their problem? Seriously. It's my horse. I paid for that with my own money. Two pennies, damn it. Two pennies from the real, real world. Do you know how hard that how hard that was to get? Yeah, I'm just making up random crap now. Anyways. Uh, what do we got here? Snag! If you came to take transfer back, you can forget it. Why don't you go think about what you've done for a change? I won't open the gate until you change your attitude. You're the one with the attitude. Leah, you don't know what happened yesterday. Listen, I don't know if I'll be able, if she'll be able to listen to me, but I'll try to explain about Tallow and the monkey, okay? You could crawl in through here, through the tunnel in the back while I do, Snag. So there just happens to be a tunnel. That's what leads to that spring as well. Just so conveniently leading into this place. Ever so conveniently, yeah. My butt. Anyways. Speaking of butts, <laughs> yeah, so we got to crawl through this tunnel right here. Not a big deal, right? It's a little cramped in here. I'm getting a little claustrophobic, but whatever. We're just going to crawl like through, right through like we usually do. I had no idea. I hadn't heard the details about Talos' capture. But Colin... So you still prefer your master over me, huh, Transfer? Don't worry about your horse, Snag. Fortunately, it looks like the injury isn't too sin serious. You two can go on together. But Snag... Can you at least promise me this? No matter what happens on your journey, please don't do anything out of your league. Please. 
Just come home safely. I found you! Oh, aren't you scary? <laughs> Are you sure you want to be doing that snarling and glaring at me? Well, that's too bad. I was planning on helping you if you were nice. <laughs> that's much better. You humans are obedient to a fault, aren't you? Oops, but you aren't a human anymore, are you? You're a beast. <laughs> there, there. Be a good boy and calm down. No need to buy. You look kind of surprised. <laughs> So, I bet you're wondering where exactly are we? 
Well, I'll make you a deal. If you can get over here, maybe I'll tell you. <laughs> Okay, let's just have a quick review of what just happened. Fat guy broke into some springs, captured my girlfriend, now we're in some kind of parallel universe or some kind of dark place where there's a whole bunch of alien freaks like this thing over here. For some freaking reason, I'm a wolf and in jail, it appears. Best day ever.